Hey guys, Eric and Angie with Backyard Shooting and I would normally do an unboxing but so this is kind of like an unveiling instead because because I already unboxed it and I even included you guys. I was going to share the video and I went to upload three different videos at one time while I was talking on the phone. <sighs> yeah, people say women are supposed to be multitaskers. I missed out completely on that gene because I uploaded two out of three of the videos and then I trashed everything. Yep, threw it right away, deleted it permanently, and then I realized I had to do it again. So instead of putting it back in the other box, I just decided I would cover it up with, this is actually a camouflage curtain because it works just as well. <laughs> So, I've got something under here. We're going to find out what it is. I already know what it is. You guys would have already if I hadn't deleted the footage. Find out what it is and get it out of the box and take a look at it. So, here we go. Three, two, one. What? <laughs> okay, so this is the Stoger XM1 Scout. I already did the Ranger. I already got the Ranger. It's actually right there behind me. See? The Stoger XM1 Ranger, that one's in 25. This one is the Stoger XM1 Scout in 25. And I guess that means that I'm gonna have to do a comparison video because as I'm speaking of it, I wanna know what the difference is. But before we do that, we are gonna do an unboxing. So let's get this guy out of its box and see what it looks like. It's looking on the box pretty similar, pretty similar to the um, Ranger. It's got the nice um, packaging, and um, yes, it did come in plastic. But but I I already unboxed it. I told you that. There is the manual, and let me get all the little bits and pieces out before um, I pull the gun out. O rings, fill probe, um, pieces and parts, accessories, rail, one mag and two mags as well as a replacement grip um, in case you want a smaller one. So all those them off of that. wonderful extra pieces because this is gonna go back in the box in just a minute. All right, let's take that out and see what's here. Let it go. I'm so comfortable in here. I don't wanna come out. Oh yeah, very similar, very similar to the Ranger. Um, has a good, nice feel to it. I'm gonna move this box out the way, so give me just a second. By the way, I think the marketing, ooh, beating it up, did a fantastic job on this box because, I mean, people might say packaging isn't important, it's what's inside the package, but you know, if I was walking through a store and I saw a bunch of black or a bunch of white boxes on the shelf, and then I saw this one, this one would probably catch my eye. I know, I know guys, it's Bronco cut, Bronco's colors, but that was for you, Carter. Um, I know that it's not always what, what is you see on the outside, but this, this box would definitely catch my eye. So good job uh, marketing on that. So let's, let's check it, check it out. I'm going to read a few things off the box first. So the trigger is three lever adjustable. Um, safety is manual on the trigger, adjustable length of pull with the, um, the shim and the, the butt pad rifled barrel. Um, 25 cal will get a max velocity of 800 feet per second with alloy pellets and with lead pellets 720 feet per se second. Um, it comes with a five year warranty. Let me just drop the box a bunch of times. And that's probably about all I need to know on the box. All right, so let's check it out. That's enough. That's enough checking out the box. Let's check out the gun. Remove all this stuff. So we get two mags. Lovely. We love an extra mag. Uh, we'd love more extra mags, but two is definitely better than one. <laughs> got accessory rail, um, pick pick rail attachments, and then of course the grip, like I said. And then we have this guy. Let me grab my handy dandy notebook. Not really. <laughs> um. So starting from. The butt to muzzle just to check it out. We're not doing a review right now or anything like that. Just as the unboxing, taking a look out of it, my a look out of it. Let me see if that works. 
<laughs> just kidding, taking a look at it um, and kind of my first impression. So it is extremely similar to the Ranger, right? The Ranger is just, is longer. The Ranger will reach out and get you. The Scout, I was trying to think of something with an S, will stop and get you. No, that was dumb. Okay, we'll, we'll, we'll stop with all that. Okay, so that's one difference right now. The Scout is much shorter than the Ranger. Um, they're both 25 cals, but it has the adjustable butt pad where you can take the shim out and make the length of pull shorter. It's got the adjustable cheek piece, the side lever cocking handle, the split pick rail. It comes with a single shot tray or two mags. It has a rifle barrel. Then we've got the fill port, the spring-loaded fill port for your probe. These are where you attach the accessory pick rails for your bipod, um, maybe your lights, whatever you put on there. It has the um, textured forearm grip as well as forearm, the textured forearm as well as the grip. The trigger is adjustable, like it said. Safety is on the trigger. Um, pretty similar and it's, it's pretty light. It's a little, eh, it's not bad. It's not bad. It's a little heavier back here, but it's pretty decent. So um, the build feels really good, nice quality. I can't wait to get out there and do some shooting with it. So guys, this is one of the um, air guns that are in the queue for some testing. Um, I don't know when I'll get to it, so please don't be impatient. I know that's really, really, really hard. I get it. But I'm going to be going out of town and be gone for a little while, so um, I will try to get to it. I'm taking it with me. I am going to take it with me, and I am going to a place where it has this really nice shooting range. I can actually do some work there. So I will get to it within the next few weeks, but I don't know when it'll post. So please be patient. This, guys, is the unboxing of the Stoger XM1 Scout. Scout. I'm Aragon Angie with Backyard Shooting. Thank you guys so much for watching. Y'all don't just have a good day. Have an awesome one. See ya.